What happens when you forgot your iPhone passcode? If you keep entering the wrong passcode on your iPhone, the iPhone may get disabled, which will make it harder to unlock. If you want to recover or reset the iPhone passcode without losing the data, keep watching the video as it will show you how to back up your data and reset your iPhone passcode. Step 1. Make a backup of your iPhone data. Launch iTunes and connect your iPhone to the computer. Then click on the phone icon and click Backup Now. Wait until the backup process is finished. Step 2. Remove the iPhone passcode with iMyPhone Lock Wiper. First, launch iMyPhone Lock Wiper. If you have connected the iPhone to computer, keep it connected and you don't need to reconnect it. Click Next and download the firmware and wait for it to verify and extract. When the extraction is completed, click Start Unlock to begin the unlocking process and follow the on-screen instruction. In this way, you can remove the passcode to reset it. If you would like to give iMyPhone Lock Wiper a try, click the download link below to give it a try. It can work for all iPhones, even if you have iPhone 12 or iPhone with iOS 14. Step 3. Get your data back to your iPhone. After resetting passcode, exit Lock Wiper and relaunch iTunes. Keep the iPhone connected to your computer. Click on the phone icon and click Restore Backup to get all the data back to your iPhone. Tips to recover iPhone passcode without losing data. Number one, always allow access to USB accessories. When using iTunes to back up your iPhone, you should keep your USB accessories enabled. Otherwise, you won't be able to successfully connect your iPhone with iTunes. Go to Settings and enter Touch ID and Passcode or Face ID and Passcode. Then scroll down to set up the USB accessories. Number 2. Keep backups on iCloud. iCloud can also be used to back up your data. Turn on your iCloud backup feature and choose the things you want to back up always, which will save you a lot of time to back up manually. That's all for this video. If you find it helpful, feel free to leave your comment below. Alright, see you next time.